everyone, it's Charlotte from the Kia Hyundai channel today and we are outside, we are not in the brand for Kia studio and that's because we are going to be doing a tire inflator kit video today. Now I have been begging my dad to film this video with me and he's just like, yeah, I don't have time, I don't have time, I don't have time. I'm like, well, let's, you know, let's film it. And still, same thing, doesn't have time. So today, we're going to force him to film it. So I'm going to take his car, which is right in front of me, beautiful. EV6 GT and uh, we're gonna we're just gonna take a little bit of air out of his tires and uh, then he'll have to film this video with me right so uh, let's get it set up and let's get it done one eternity later all right, so here is my uh, handiwork so far. I put the cap back on and I'm just gonna tell him I think it's a nail or something like that. But for right now, let's go and hide the evidence and then we will go and tell him. Hey, I just brought your car back, but I think I picked up a nail or something because they're doing all that construction down the street. So do you wanna come out and check on it? Yeah. It's, it's probably just a nail. Do you have the inflator kit? Yeah, I've got an extra, oh, we're supposed to, is that what you're videoing? I am now. We're supposed to do a, uh, I've been saying for a while that we're going to do a video, so I guess we might as well Well, I, I guess today is the day. Yeah, so, okay, so, can I do this one-handed? I've got the inflator kit right here, because uh, I pulled it out. So you can see in your car you're going to have a tire mobility kit. Um, and then in there... In there, you can see you've got well, a tool, um, a compressor, and then the stuff that goes in to seal any holes. So, yeah, let's go out. Hey, everybody. As you know, this is Pat from Brantford Kia, the Kia Hyundai channel. And so, we've been talking about doing a time mobility kit um, video for some time, and it looks like out of necessity, we're going to shoot it. Now, I'm going to show you how you connect the um, liquid that seals in any cracks or anything so that it holds air but because we're here at the dealership I'm going to get the guys to pull the wheel off and actually uh, fix it um, so I'm not actually going to use the stuff but here what here we have a compressor we've got our um, sealant and so all we're going to do is we're going to unscrew the cap here unscrew the red cap screw that in so now when we're inflating the tire it's also inflating the um, or it's also spreading the the sealant and then we're going to take the compressor and you can see there's a big long cord here somewhere here it is and so we need to plug that into like a, cig a cigarette lighter there's one in the back of the ev6 Where's Gabby when you need her, eh? Tell me about it. Okay, and then all we're gonna do is unscrew the cap right here. Now I run with nitrogen in my tires, so um, I'm gonna have the guys put nitrogen in, but if you were at the side of the road, this is what you'd wanna do. Attach it. can tell how often I do this all right and then I am simply gonna turn it on oh I got to turn the car on hold on do you have the key to my car okay so you can see here that the tire pressure is being registered and this will take a little bit of time but it is going to fill the tire to the appropriate tire pressure. So this will probably take like 20 minutes so we'll come back and check it.
Okay, so one of the things I didn't talk about is if you want to see where to set the tire pressure at, the door sticker here is going to tell you what the PSI should be. So I knew that it was 39 and so I set it to 40. Um, and that took a lot less time than I thought. I was expecting it to take about 20 minutes. Realistically, it probably took about five. So now what I would do is, um, previous to this, I would have checked to see if there was any obvious uh, screw or anything in it. And there are some tools in the kit where you can pull that out. Now what we want to do is we need to do a little bit of a drive to let the, um, the sealant cover the tire. And then you're going to want to go to a dealership and get it checked uh, for real. Um, no more than 80 kilometers an hour and you don't really don't want to go more than 50, 50 kilometers. So I'm just going to disconnect this and I can hear my grandbaby crying. So I am, I am going to just check around. And that is how we do it. Okay, so that is basically what you need to know when you have a flat tire, how you can inflate it, how you can seal the um, uh, seal it with the sealant. Now you got to go to the dealership and get it inspected. And I'm just packing up the kit and closing up the car. I don't know how the guys left that out here, but... Someone's going to be looking for that. Yeah, that's and, that's really weird. Anyways, that is the tire mobility kit out of necessity. We have filmed the video. Thanks, guys. All right, everyone. Well, thank you so much for watching today's video. We hope that for those of you who may need to know how to use a tire mobility kit in the future, that you found this video helpful. Uh, for those of you who just enjoyed watching it, thank you guys so much for sticking around. And uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe and like this video. And we will see you guys next time. Bye.